Well, as you can as you can imagine, uh, my my opinion of what some of them are doing ha is is not changed at all. I was against it yesterday and the day before. Uh, the fact of the matter is, we've had a public health emergency in our country uh, and in the state of Louisiana since March, and you need all of the tools at, at your disposal in order to effectively and timely uh, manage that emergency and and do everything that, that's necessary. And I know that there are some people who, who are tired of the virus, but that doesn't mean that the virus is going to listen to that and leave us alone. And in fact, that's not happening anywhere around the country and in many places around the world uh, where numbers are actually starting to surge again. That hasn't started here in Louisiana, uh, thank God, uh, but it's certainly possible. Um, and, and so it would be sheer lunacy uh, to, to prematurely end the declaration of emergency and put at risk not just the funding that we receive from the federal government, but our ability uh, to respond as we need to, whether it's using the National Guard or, or the state police. Um, you know, we're, we're going to potentially be asking the president to approve again non-congregant sheltering. Well, the reason that is in order is because of the public health emergency. If we don't have a declared public health emergency, how can we ask him to approve the additional expense associated with sheltering people? You know, and, and there are so many other things that, that go into this, um, and, and it's, it's really, um, it, as I mentioned before, it, it's, it's not a good idea uh, to, to pursue that. Um, I, I know that it is a minority of legislators who are pushing for it. Uh, the sooner that, that we resolve uh, these issues, the better and restore the certainty that the people of Louisiana need. Uh, but I will tell you as governor, as the person in the state of Louisiana constitutionally charged with the authority, but also the obligation to take care of the people of Louisiana, I will continue to do that. I will use every tool at uh, my disposal as necessary to do it. And I will surrender none of those tools uh, because people uh, have some unrealistic idea about this public health emergency.